Hi guys, welcome to this video looking at how metals are found in the earth, in particular what ores are. Nice and simply then, if we start off with a definition, an ore is a rock that contains a metal that is profitable. So you've got to be able to get a profit out of it to make it worthwhile. So if I had a metal that cost £1,000 to extract, but I'm only going to get £900 from it, I'm not going to make a profit. I'll be down £100. Therefore, we class that as not an ore, we class it as a low-grade ore because it's not profitable to extract it. If I have one, however, that still costs £1,000 to extract, but I'm going to get £2,400 out of it, I'm going to make a profit, therefore we class that as an ore, and in particular a high-grade ore. Now, not all metals are actually found in ores. There are some really unreactive ones that are found uncombined in the earth, just as the metal. Those are silver AG, gold AU, and platinum PT. All you need to do with those ones is dig them out the ground, because they're already existing as their metals. Okay, let's have a look at a couple of questions then. First one says describe what an ore is. It's worth two marks, so you need two points. The second one is explain why some metals are not worth extracting. Also two marks. And then why is gold not found in an ore for the third question. Pause the video, have a go at each now, and we'll see how you've done in a minute. Okay, let's see how you've done. So the first question, describe what an ore is. Nice and simply, it is a rock that contains a metal. And then for the second mark, so you've got to be able to get a profit out of it. So I've written that is profitable to extract. Question two, explain why some metals are not worth extracting. They're classed as low-grade ores, and they will not give a profit. Or you could have some sort of description of that, saying it's more expensive to extract them than the metal is worth. Question three, why is gold not found in an ore? Nice and simple, it's unreactive. It does not react, it doesn't oxidise, and therefore it's found uncombined. That brings this video to an end. There is a review question for you, which says, describe why silver and copper are found in different forms in the earth. So you need to talk about the fact one of them is an ore, one of them will be uncombined, and why in terms of reactivity. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please click on like down below. You can also subscribe to get more updates. You can visit the website for more information, and you can look at my latest video. Thanks for watching.